Warning, this article contains spoilers from all seasons of Outlander and an echo when the Bones season 6 of Outlander finished on a dramatic note as Claire Fraser, played by Catriona Balfe, faced counts of both witchcraft and murder for Malva Christie's, Jessica Reynolds, tragic demise. As Claire prepared to be put on trial, Tom Christie, Mark Lewis Jones, gallantly lied and confessed to the murder of his own daughter, clear in the knowledge Claire was innocent and taking the fall for her. Although Tom had initially been disapproving of Claire and her work as a healer, he was eventually won over by her when she managed to repair his damaged hand. Does Jamie Fraser know Tom Christie is in love with Claire? The preacher had inadvertently fallen in love with Claire and couldn't let her die, particularly for a crime he knew she could never commit. Sadly, it wasn't looking good for the time traveler who was last seen trying to perform an unsuccessful cesarean to save Malva's unborn child. Although Tom's feelings weren't explicitly dealt with in the show, it was heavily implied he had strong emotions toward her and was willing to put his life on the line. The seventh Outlander novel, A Neck When the Bone, delves more into Tom's feelings for Claire. Why was season 6 of Outlander so short? Outlander season 6 wrapped in June but some fans of the Stars series are curious to know why the current outing was so short, Express. Co.uk has the lowdown. Tom and Claire unexpectedly meet each other with the preacher questioning whether Jamie Fraser, Sam Hewen, was aware of his feelings. In the book, Claire confirms Jamie is well aware of Tom's unrequited feelings towards her and understands them as someone who is in love with her. Given Jamie and Claire have a strong relationship and don't keep anything from each other, including Tom's feelings. In the past, Jamie and Claire have had to be candid about many things, particularly during their time apart for 20 years. During this time, Jamie slept with Mary McNabb, Emma Campbell Jones, the day before he would be going to Ardsmuir Prison as an act of kindness. He also revealed he'd had a love child with Lady Geneva Dunsany, Hannah James, while working as an indentured servant at the Hellwater Estate. To top it off, Jamie married Clara's nemesis Leary McKenzie, Nell Hudson, and was still with her when she returned to the past. Season 6 saw Jamie and Claire's relationship pushed to breaking point after she fell ill and hallucinated her husband was cheating on her with Malva. The pair had a tense confrontation during which she told Jamie, I don't belong here. Brianna, Roger don't belong here and Jemmy shouldn't be here. But yet here we all are, all of us, because I loved you more than the life that I had and because I believed that you loved me in the same way. Because you do and I know that or are you going to tell me that's not the truth? Jamie responded and said he would not ever say such a thing because it wasn't true. Don't miss. BBC's Great Expectations is drivel say critics, latest country file fans fuming over shameful chicken waste segment, latest The Chases and Hegerty pays tribute to co-star, latest, nonetheless, he did then tell her about sleeping with Mary McNabb, there's no good way to tell your wife you're playing with someone else under the circumstances. You were gone. Only once. Christ. The last thing I want to do is upset you Sassanac by making it sound as though it was. I don't wish to malign the poor woman. Mary McNabb. He added, she'd seen you with me Claire. She kept the look of true love when she saw it. It wasn't in her mind to betray that. She gave me a small thing. She gave me tenderness. I hope I gave her the same. This scene underscored the love and trust between Jamie and Claire with the couple never keeping these sort of secrets from each other. 
Outlander Season 7 will air later this year and Seasons 1 to 6 are streaming on Lionsgate Plus now.